the ascetic and the slain cloth. In a forest near a village, there lived a guru and his disciple who spent all that time in prayer and meditation. Then one day, My son, I have to leave you for a while. I am going on a pilgrimage. Remember, all that I have taught you and above all, lead a simple life. I will, Gurudev. And the Guru left. One morning, as usual, the ascetic washed his spare loin cloth and hung it out to dry. I will now go to the village to beg for alms. May God bless you for your kindness. Later, when the ascetic returned to his hut, Hey, that looks like a piece of my loin cloth. It is. The rats have torn it to shreds. I will have to beg for another. The next day at the village. Mother, I need a loin cloth. Can you spare me one? A loin cloth? The rats caught at mine and tore it off. I need another. I have a new one. I will give it to you. The man went in and came back with it. Here you are, holy sage. The next morning. Today, I will hang my cloth high up here on the roof. But that afternoon. Oh no, the rats have torn up this one too. I have to get myself a cat. So the ascetic got himself a cat. And soon the rat stopped troubling him. I must keep my cat well fed. I know what I will get myself a cow. And so he got himself a cow. My cat has as much milk as it needs and more. But I need straw to feed my cow. How shall I go about getting that? I could cultivate the land around my hut. And when the grain is harvested, I will have all the straw my cow would need. Accordingly, Asetik began to till the land around his hut. Soon, What a fine crop I have harvested. The straw my cow will have, but what shall I do with the grain? I will need a barn to store it in. So the ascetic hired labors to build bands for him. Sir, is this all right? No, make it taller. There is plenty of grain to be stored. The ascetic had now become a landlord. I need a wife to help me manage all this. I think I will marry. And so, one fine day, the guru returned from his pilgrimage. Am I on the right road? Where is my disciple's little hut? Has some rich man driven my poor disciple away and built his estate here? When a servant came out of the house, the guru went up to him. My good man, an ascetic used to live here once. Do you know where he is now? Hi! <laughs> Just then, the servant's master himself came out. My lord, you! He rushed forward and fell at his guru's feet. My son, what is all this? I left you leading the simple life of an ascetic. I returned to find you surrounded by wealth and possession. How did this happen? Oh, Gurudev, it's all behind with a single loincloth. To protect it from the rats, I need a cat, and then there was no end to my needs. Forgive me, Gurudev.